I have something to say. So, when I was young, I went to a lot of retreats and events and different kinds of things where women would give talks on modesty. And the thing that I always loathed about these talks was the first reason why these women told me that I should cover up my body. The first reason that was always presented to me as to why I should do that went something like this. You know, our brothers in Christ are visual creatures and what the way you dress could lead them to lustful thoughts. And so you should cover up so that you don't lead them to impurity and you can help them on their walk of faith. <gasps> Do I think that that is an important and good thing? Yes. I think that we have a responsibility to one another as Christians to help each other on our walks of faith. But I so disagree with that being the first reason that people tell young women that sh they should cover up their bodies. I didn't understand why I had to do something for men and why I couldn't do it for myself first. That was very confusing for me. The first reason that I should cover up my body, that I do cover up my body, is because I am a woman of inherent dignity and worth. When I was shopping, when I was going through my closet, it was a lot harder for me to ask myself the question when I'm looking at clothes, like, is this gonna lead um, guys to lustful thoughts? Like, is this going to lead them to impurity? It was way easier to ask myself the question, does this outfit, dress, top, whatever, reflect outwardly that I am a woman of class and dignity and self-respect. That question was way easier to answer. That question was the driving force as to why I decided to dress in my life as a woman of modesty and class and reflect my dignity in the way that I dress. As a Christian woman, I also believe that God dwells within me. Does that mean that I have to be, you know, some frumpy old woman who wears turtlenecks all the time? No, I can dress as a woman of dignity and class and be hip and modern and dazzling at the same time and reflect outwardly my belief that I hold very dear to me that my body is a sacred place. When I do that, I indirectly help my brothers in Christ in what those women always told me about was their walk you know, of faith toward purity, etc. But the first reason why is for myself to outwardly proclaim to the world like my body belongs to me. As I heard these talks, I kind of developed an aversion to the word modesty because I just so, it so didn't sit right with me that I had to do it for guys. And like, while I get that that's a beautiful virtue, I had to reframe it for like thinking about the way I dress. In my life now, I have re reframed the word modesty to the word classy. I aim to dress as a woman of class, a classy woman. When I think of classy women, I think of women like Kate Middleton. Yes, she's a princess. Maybe you're not a princess. I'm not a princess. But the way she dresses, she dresses with incredible class. And in her dressing classy, she shows the world. I'm a woman of great dignity, of great value, of incredible worth. I love watching the way that she presents herself. And I think that that works so much better for me in my mind. Like going through my closet or going through like racks at the store, like does this show that I'm a classy woman? Like is this outfit classy or is it not? If it's not, I don't wear it. I don't choose it. You know, I don't buy it. I have adopted the idea in my life that like there are two parallel lines and one is the amount of skin I show and one is the amount of power that I have and they are not ever, ever, ever things that intersect. When I show the world that I am a woman of great class and dignity and self-respect, that is a powerful thing. And that like, like to me, that makes me feel strong and that makes me feel beautiful and that makes me feel empowered. I don't dress as a woman of class and dignity to help men. I think it's great to help men, but I dress as a woman of class and dignity because I am one. And if men are indirectly helped by that, I think that's a beautiful thing because I want to help men on their walk of faith toward purity. But I dress as a woman of class and dignity because I am one, because I believe that my body is sacred, that I have infinite worth and value, because I have self-respect and because I love myself and because my body belongs to me. That's why. That's all for today. I'll talk to you soon.